Welcome to the channel, everyone. It's so great to have you back. Today, we're watching uh, a show that I've never seen before in my life. Uh, I mean, I know of its existence, or else I wouldn't be in a position of uh, being able to watch this with you. However, I'm excited because Futurama, I know off by heart. Uh, South Park also, so we're, we haven't done South Park yet, but I mean, we can do that at one point. Um, however, Smiling Friends is a show that airs on Adult Swim, I believe. And it's, apparently it's, uh, it's, uh, quite, uh, popular. Uh, I couldn't tell you why. So maybe if you want to tell me a little bit about this show, you can drop uh, a comment in the comment section below. That would be awesome. Say hi and uh, maybe let me know how you like the show. Maybe you've never seen the show. Maybe you're watching this for the first time with me. That would be awesome. We'd be doing something together. Now, I'm sorry, I'm a bit, I'm a bit hyper today. Don't know why, but I feel like uh, it's, it's a, you know, uh, it's, it's a good day to make a video, a good day to make a react video. Now I do not know what smiling, so I know Rick and Morty, but I do not know smiling friends and I'm excited to just to watch this with you. It's a little bit out of context. Uh, this video is called, it's on the internet clips that cure my depression. I don't know if this is gonna be dark humor. I'm guessing it's for uh, adults because it's on Adult Swim. But maybe, maybe I'm wrong and maybe it's for children and uh, but maybe it can still be fun. Maybe it's awful, maybe it's sad, maybe it's depressing, maybe it's brutal like Rick and Morty. I have no idea. But you know what? I'm not gonna find out just looking in the camera and doing nothing, right? I'm only gonna find out if I hit play so people, join me as I press play, and I hope you love this. Let's have some fun. Actually, this feels like a little bit of history, because uh, this is the first time I'm doing this. All right, let's go. Charlie, what are you supposed to be? I, I've seen way too many people get their careers ruined over old Halloween costumes. I'm not doing it. Why don't you just put on some face paint and be a zombie or something? Dude, face paint gets people in way more trouble than anything else. I mean, I have no idea what's going to be offensive in 10 years. When you put on a costume, you can be anything! Well, I mean, it sounds like his friend got a really good advice. Just go as a zombie and you'll be safe because everybody loves zombies. Where everybody loves killing zombies. It depends, really. Um, but you know, don't, don't. You're yellow, so you shouldn't apply black makeup on your face, because in ten years that might be a problem. It might be, uh, might be a problem in ten minutes, actually. Actually, hit it. What the? F so I usually just go in there and pick some crap off the floor. What? What the? F pants? So I'm positive you're not gonna hit that. Oh, so that's like a BB gun or something. So you shot the, the, the glass and the glass, the, the, the bottle. Okay, you actually hit it. Oh, what the f <laughs> So I usually just... <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So this is awesome because I thought... <laughs> of course it's a show for adults. I mean, look how they look. They look kind of like, mmm. Are they going to throw up? I don't know. They might throw up. Let's keep watching, though. I like that it's for adults, right? So, go in there and pick some crap off the floor. And oh, okay. what? Oh, I was just saying, okay. Oh, yeah, it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> Wait! One more thing. Whatever you do, don't go beyond the rickety bridge. Because you'll get lost! I like twigs and I want some more. What? Oh, thank you, Mr. Boone. Mm mm. This is so, this is fucked up. I, I'm sorry for the swearing, but this looks like a cute show, but I, I bet it's going to have like this edge to it and it's going to be really like nasty or something. Let's see. I wish I had something with a bit more girth. 
Oh, mm. that's more like it. If I just mark the trees like a true pioneer, I'll be able to find my way back no problem. <laughs> oh, fudge. <laughs> Oh. What? Ah, <gasps> no. Oh God, no. Everything's gonna be fine. I could see myself <sighs> settling down here. Right there is where my exotic wife will sit and knit me beautiful quilts. Hello, wifey. Hello, Pip. I do love you. Hello, my baby. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. What do I do? Run, baby. Run, baby. Run, baby. You'll never escape. You're gonna die here. Oh my god, look at that! What the hell? <gasps> Whoa! Is that blackface, dude? No, 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 this isn't blackface, I'm an actual demon. Bro, please tell me. Whoa, that is. <laughs> I love this. Okay, so they're doing. It's still Halloween now. The I don't know what his name is. The little um, is he pink? Is it is he pink? The little pink guy. I felt really sorry for him. It was really like really uh quite the evil dead experience. Is this? Is this also part of the experience? Is he from Evil Dead? Maybe I don't. I, Excuse me. Cool, man. No, 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 no. You don't understand. I'm literally a forest demon from across the bridge. This isn't a costume. Get the out, man. <gasps> See, that's exactly why I don't dress up for Halloween. Right there. That's the reason. Wow. Okay. You know, you can just wear a mask for Halloween next time, you know, just wear a mask, ghost face, something for Halloween. That's just no makeup. The, the stuff that doesn't involve makeup is a good, good way to go. Although I do find it strange that, you know, back a few years back on Halloween, it was kind of the thing to be inappropriate with your costume but okay no, not inappropriate yes because it's gory but not in bad taste because it's racist right so there should be like a common ground uh on what is okay and what is not anyway this is going really like what am i talking about blackface still he's dead the blackface tree demon is dead so How is that even fair? You're just button mashing, Blip. There's no skill to that. Eric, you're just button. How is that even fair? You're just button mashing, Blip. There's no skill to that. Even fair. You're just button. That is awesome. Mashing, Blip. There's no skill to that. Oh. My ear is still ringing from that noise. Salutations. I am in dire need of travelers who might be interested in a quest. No. Good day. If my tribe is to survive the winter, I'll need 15 boar hides from- No! Oh, dude, that was not even fantasy. That's just an alien. Perhaps one day. Oh, I love you, Daddy. Oh. <sighs> you kiss your dad in the mouth? <laughs> <laughs> this is the most obnoxious thing I've ever seen about the mouth. Perhaps one day. Oh, I love you, Daddy. <sighs> you kiss your dad in the mouth. Yeah, that's that's how. What that's that would have been my follow up question. To be fair. Anyway, moving on. This is a very straight show, people. Like I am. We've watched, I've watched three minutes, yeah? This thing is six minutes long or something, and is, and they've already eaten, like, a tree flesh demon alive for Halloween? Is that a tradition I didn't know about? Okay, all right, I don't know. Let's keep moving. 
This is the most obnoxious thing I've ever experienced in my life. Oh, we were right there, man! The princess? How queer. Boons. Oh, sorry, but I've got a pretty bad headache, man. Is it okay if you could not... Let's continue. Yeah, a creature of the forest is in trouble. You must be a hero. Ah. Yeah, you know, when you, when you put it like that, I guess it does, you know, make sense. We're ending the thousand-year war between the aliens and the spiders. We humbly give to you the crown of Zimblar. I thought you said aliens. I feel like I can't unsee that, if you understand what I mean. Oh. That fantasy, Charlie. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'd call it sci-fi slash fantasy. Oh, Mip just hates nasty arguments. Look what you did, man. Charlie, I think I found a hero worthy of delivering my gift. Who? It's, uh, it's you, Charlie. I'm the one who's honored to be in the presence of such a hero. Well, maybe it was your song that helped me become a hero. Well, maybe I like that. What's going on here? Charlie knows how much I love the Enchanted Forest. Is he doing this on purpose? It's like I don't even exist. Now I'm gonna go into this package and do the final quest. Ah. Oh. Oh. Oh shit, I was not yeah, well, that, that genuinely took me off guard. I got stuck in a vicious dopamine cycle. Oh my god. Oh shit. The whole time? Oh, that movie was epic! I don't, I don't know, man. I didn't really enjoy it that much, to be honest. What? Yeah, really? Okay, okay, okay. Look, to be completely fair, I did really enjoy the scene when Bimblar went rogue and he beat that woman in the head with the hammer. I thought it was artistically and, like, tastefully done. I thought it was a, a well done scene. <laughs> it's funny, that was the part I really didn't like. <laughs> Fast food restaurants do this healthy food shit. Uh, yeah, after some recent budget cuts, we're no longer in charge of murder mysteries. Another team handles that now. Hey, Charlie, the owner of the famous Salty's restaurant was just brutally murdered, and I need you and Finn to figure out who did it. Thank you, bye. And don't forget about me, Grace. I could have done it. And none of you are leaving until we solve this. You didn't need to raise your voice, man. You guys spent all day doing that? Day. We did have a little break to have a little kiss in the closet. <laughs> All right, noted. Um, that's just straight up beautiful, by the way. I spent all day <laughs> my costume. Hmm, a stain of what? <laughs> my own duty. <laughs> <laughs> that is straight up beautiful, by the way. <laughs> that really got me. That is. Okay. For your information, I happen to have a serious drug problem, which causes me to squirt out my ass into my costume. Oh, fair enough. I'm genuinely sorry. That sounds terrible. Yeah, no dip. Okay, yeah, that actually checks out. Uh... Oh, all right, fine. You pushed me hard enough, and now I'm forced to admit it. Yes, Salty and I were having a steamy affair. What of it? Oh. Can't a poor mustard like me ever have a little fun? Mustard. Yeah, fun. You like to have fun, too? I mean, you know, you're asking about me? I mean, yeah, I, yeah, I like fun, yeah. You know? Oh, yeah? <laughs> I already said yes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're all done here. Oh, it's just a little bit of playful spit, Pim. They're just having fun. But also, that cup thing has got a bad energy about it, man. Just a bad vibe. Oh, uh, I can feel the cold and of dead taking me away. Thank you, Egg. Oh, no, 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 not that one. No, 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 other drawer, other drawer. Oh, I'm sorry. Aren't you sick of seeing all your favorite fast food restaurants becoming healthy and cleaning up their image? Fast food should be greasy and make your heart palpitate. Yeah, but I'd never break the sixth commandment, dude. Let's and that is where the video ends now. Wow. Well, I don't know what I just watched, honestly. Um... I don't know if this is more like a clip show with like random gags. I've seen that episode one is like 10 minutes, 11 minutes long. So I really don't know in what kind of format, in what kind of world this kind of fits. 
but I liked a lot of this. I thought it was funny and it made me laugh. I do think, I think this show is funnier with context than without context, probably, but we can find out uh, next time because I don't know where to watch this show. Uh, and uh, I'm, I'm probably not gonna be able to watch this show unfortunately but hopefully someday so right that was that was really cool excuse me i'm gonna totally cut that uh, uh, i'm edit uh. thank you so much for watching my react to smiling friends uh which I've seen now for the first time and I've enjoyed. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you would like to support me and my channel, please hit the subscribe button. I always wanted to say subscribe channel. Eat the subs eat the subscribe. No, I can't even. You eat food. You subscribe to channels. Please subscribe to my channel. Uh, I would like to personally thank my Patreons uh, who have been supporting me uh, since its launch. We have Karina, we have F78K, and we have Johannes as part of the community who is helping me on the Patreon. If you would like to join that community, please do. With that all being said, I would like to wish you a wonderful, beautiful, peaceful start to the new week. Thank you so much for joining me. Be safe. Be well. Goodbye.